Good afternoon, everybody. How are you all? Today we are going to discuss a problem on finding arc length. So I will share my screen with you. Find the arc length of the graph of the function over the indicated interval. The function is y equal to 3 by 2 times x to the power of 2 third plus 4. And the interval is from 1 to 27. So first we will find the derivative of y with respect to x, which can be written as so let me change the color of my solution. Solution. First, we will find dy by dx is equal to 3 by 2 x 2 third minus 1 divided by 2 third minus 1. So this is equal to 3 by 2 times x two-third minus three over three divided by two-third minus three over three. In this case, I've written one as three divided by three. So this will be equal to three by two x minus one-third divided by two minus three is minus uh, one-third. Okay, so this is your dy by dx. So dy by dx is equal to 3 by 2 times minus 1 third. When it comes in the numerator, it becomes 3 over 1. And we have x to the power of minus 1 third. So dy by dx is equal to you know I did a mistake, so let me rectify my mistake. I'm doing a derivative, so this is all wrong. I'm not doing an integration. So, so this will be times two third minus one. Sorry, this is also wrong. So let me clarify this. So we know y equal to xn, if y is equal to x to the power of n, then dy by dx is equal to n x n minus 1. So in this case, y is equal to 3 by 2 x to the power of 2 third. So dy by dx is equal to 3 by 2 multiplied by 2 over 3 x 2 third minus 1. So which is equal to Two, this two cancels with this two, this three cancels with this three. And x to third minus one can be written as three over three. So x to the power of minus one third. So hence dy by dx is equal to one over x to the power of one third. Okay, now I will create some space and use the arc length formula. Okay, so s. 
is equal to the arc length is equal to integration and this is the x is from 1 to 27. So arc length s is using the formula of arc length is from 1 to 27 integration or square root of integration the limits are from 1 to 27 1 plus dy by dx square and dx okay so s is equal to integration from 1 to 27 square root of 1 plus 1 over x to the power of 1 third square dx which is equal to integration from 1 to 27 x 1 third square is uh, x 2 third plus 1 divided by x 2 third okay dx okay now we have to complete this integration so let me create some more space So this will be this will be the two third when we do the integration it becomes the exponent two third becomes three when it comes outside is three by two. This I'm creating in order to simplify the integration. So I multiplied by 3 over 2. I have to divide by 2 over 3. So 3 to 3rd square root of x to 3rd plus 1. Okay. Integration in I have to multiply by 2 3rd and since I have taken x two third outside the square root in the denominator, it becomes, uh, remember x two third was in the denominator here. And when I take it outside the square root, it becomes one over x one third, okay, dx, okay. And this is now I will do the integration. So basically in this step, I multiplied by three by two, and I divided by two by three, so so that it remains one. And I took the x two third out of the square root to make it x one third. Okay, so this becomes three by two, which was already outside the integration, times two third x to the power of two third plus one. And the limits of integration are from 1 to 27, okay, which is equal to 3 by 2 and this 2 will cancel with this 2, this 3 will cancel with this 3. So we will have, when we put in the limits, the first limit out. The higher limit is 27, 2 third plus 1 minus 1 to the power of 2 third plus 1. Okay, and remember the lower limit is 1. Okay, so this will be equal to 3 cubed. The whole thing is raised to the power of 2 third plus 1 minus 1 to the power of 2 third is 1 plus 1, which will be equal to 3 cubed to the power of 2 third is basically 3 square plus 1 minus 
Do something I forgot at three by two power here. Okay. So there is a three by two power here. So three by two, and this is three by two. So three square plus one, three by two, minus two to the power of three by two. Or this is equal to three square is nine plus one is 10, three by two power minus two to the power of two to the power of three by two. And that is equal to, if you use your calculator, 28.794. So this is the answer for the arc length for the given function when the limits of integration are from 1 to 27. I will stop here today. If you have any question or comment, write me a note. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Thanks for watching. Uh, I'll appreciate it if you give me a thumbs up if you like this video. If you like this video, please share with your friends. You and your friends, please subscribe to my channel by hitting the red subscribe button. I'm coming back next time with another interesting problem, interesting solution. Thanks for watching. Take care. Have a nice day. See you next time.